Hello all you mayhem makers, Mindy with Quilting Mayhem, and I'm here to show you about uh, this month's Bernina Accessory of the Month, which is the number 44 C foot. So uh, in case you're wondering how to actually use it, uh, I thought I'd just show you a couple simple steps. So I'm going to flip you over, go to this machine. So I'm just demoing on 790 Pro. So as you can see, you do have the foot already attached. I have dropped feed dogs, so over on the side, you'll make sure you push in that little button. All right, and then let's show you the screen. So make sure your foot is changed over to the 44C, and I have lengthened my stitch to three, because um, I like a little bit bigger stitch when I free motion quilt. I'm going to change my speed here. I had it pretty darn high, and we're going to see if I can do <laughs> <laughs> some one-handed free motion quilting and I'm gonna use the power button you can use the foot control but I just like turning that guy on and then as you can see it just helps you move around okay. I'm gonna turn this off I think the big plus of this foot, and I use this on the long arm on the Q series, I like that it is a cupped foot in here. I'll even pull it off and show you. Um, and it's clear, so you can see what's going on with it. So let's see if we can show you. All right, clear. It is got that beveled edge. So if you're going over, especially applique, anything thick, uh, the foot's not going to get caught and stuck. It's going to glide right over the top. It has this nice wide opening, so if you're trying to do even like a free motion with a zigzag or a serpentine, you can do that. So um, it is, as I throw it on the floor, a multi-purpose foot. So <laughs> uh, it is the one that's on sale this month, 25% off. So if you like doing free motion and you're struggling maybe with some of the other feet, this may be the one you want to try. Hope you have a lovely day. Keep on stitching.